purchase your track today. Then later on, Niceville scoring a little more conventionally, getting the ball to Azaria Thomas. Do you think the game was better this week? Do you think it went better? Do you think we played better? What do you think the reason for that was? Because you had better attention to detail, better intensity at practice, okay? And when the Eagles practice that way, we start to get ahead of people, all right? So that's the lesson. Real proud of you. Jeremy's got the breakdown. Let's go. Hey, family on three. One, two, three. Bowie, they waiting on who next. I'm so proud of the twos. They left their starters in trying to bomb us away, trying to play last second, throw a Hail Mary. We're blitzing everybody. We didn't let up. Twos, great job. Y'all held up that goose oh, yeah. 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 right, go. For the twos, two. 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 two claps. Two claps. Let's go. Eagles, give me two claps in the rim. Woo! We got the beat. Pop it yeah, up. Hey. The Niceville Eagles will ask, ask you to please pause for a moment of silence in recognition of two Niceville High School football legends who recently passed away. Rodney McCants was a Niceville Eagles football captain in 1985, played linebacker and running back. Rodney went on to serve in the United States Army where he received a Bronze Star for his selfless and heroic service to our nation. Danton Barto was a captain of the greatest Niceville Eagles football team ever, the 1988 state champions. Danton went on to stardom at the University of Memphis, being named three-time All-American linebacker. Please join me in a moment of silence for two Niceville greats, Rodney McCants and Danton Barto.